What is up guys, Potsy30 here, and welcome back to Sunday Funday. Um, in this one, we're actually going to do a QA. and a I, um, I asked some of my Facebook groups, um, uh, to ask me questions if they would like, and I got some pretty good ones. Um, so before we actually get into that, I got a couple things that I want to talk about. First, the everyday, you know, everything. Um, been pretty busy actually, I got a lot going on, um... I have like five papers to write, so this is going to be interesting. I also have a final project for my Blender class that I will actually be putting up once it's actually done. Um, it's it's coming along. I have a very good idea from what I'm told. Um, so, yeah. That should be interesting. A um, couple more things. I did get a new uh, keyboard, I guess what you could call it, um, because that's exactly what it is. Uh, there it is, yeah, look at that, look at that motherfucker. It's beautiful, isn't it? Like it. Yeah. Whoa! You guys, you guys disappeared on me. Why'd you do that? Anyway, uh, another thing, I got these last week, I don't know if I showed you guys, but, yeah, got me some glasses. Probably won't be wearing them because of the camera, and... That's very glary, but yeah, uh, wow. If you guys um, follow me on Snapchat, I'm actually wearing them a decent amount. It kind of looks weird, because I got my uh, OBS sitting right here, right underneath the camera. It's like, you, you you look strange now. You look very strange. Not not you guys, but the, the guy right underneath, that's me. Uh, completely different, I think. I think I look good in the glasses, but... Tell me what you guys think. Uh, all input is good. Um, I can't help the way I look about, with it, but pff, why not, right? Um, but on to the Q&A. As I said before, I did go into the Facebook group and ask um, if they would want to ask me some questions, whether it be personal, funny, whatever you want to really ask, and I would answer accordingly. So, let's get started. I actually wrote them all down. Um, yeah. Let's get going. If you could eat a full bowl of cornflakes and spill your coffee, how much bananas would a monkey throw at you? Okay, first of all, it's it's how many bananas. How many bananas would a monkey throw at you? And the answer to that would be two. Plus a uh, handful of boop. Yeah. Who is your top three big YouTubers and who are your top three small YouTubers? Well, okay. First, my top three uh, bigger YouTubers are actually Jacksepticeye, Minilad, and probably um, I Am Wildcat. Just because they are the ones that inspired me to actually even start the channel. If it wasn't for them inspiring me to do that, I wouldn't be sitting here talking to you guys while talking to a camera. Which, in turn, will be talking to you guys because I want you guys to feel like... You're here with me instead of me talking to this thing. Like, high five? Ugh, yeah! That's right. You just give me a high five, I hope. If not, rewind it and give me a high five, please. That'd be awesome. <laughs> but my favorite, uh, my top three smaller YouTubers also have helped me a lot. Um, not just by uh, their videos, per se, but because they're genuine people. They're awesome. They're nice. Uh, they're caring. I talk to them a lot. They're actually Gentleman Maj, Savage Dragon, and Michael Marie. So thank you guys. I will actually leave all six uh, links in the description so you guys can check them out as well. What game started your love for gaming? And can your it can be your first one that you are or the one that you were addicted to so much you couldn't stop playing the game. That's probably going to be Turok. You know, the the original, I think it was either early 2000s or late, um, late 1900s, so late 1990s. Um, Turok was just awesome. You gotta fucking shoot dinosaurs. Well, not really. I guess you didn't shoot them, but you, you fucking hunted dinosaurs. And shot little bitches with your bow and arrow, but dinosaurs! <laughs> Stupid. Did the chicken come first or the egg? 
Now this question, that's all up to you guys. Whether you believe in the Christian, um, all animals were actually created right there and then. Um, or if you believe in evolution where, you know, dinosaurs kind of created the, uh, or th they adapted to their environment and ended up becoming birds and later, well, chickens, of course. Um, but I think it was actually a little bit of both. There was probably some sort of poultry that was created, and it, that poultry adapted to that. I, I mean, that's just my feeling. Um, I know there's more science to it, probably, or there's more, I don't know, beliefs that you could believe in. Um, I don't know. I just, I, I just don't know. Yeah. How long do you intend on going with YouTube, and how does it affect your every day life personality well honestly I just hope I get big enough so that I can you know at least be recognized as a, a decent youtuber a good youtuber um, not only because the fame like I really don't care if I become famous I want to really help people like that's the main reason I actually made this channel is so that I can help people through hard times um, so I could possibly even do live streams and help you know donate to charity I really want to just be able to help people, whether it's through charity or just, you know, putting a smile on somebody's face, having them laugh at some stupid joke or me getting smacked in the face, like, you know, uh, yeah, yeah, laugh at that. No, well, I don't care if you do, but anyway, my point is, no, I'm not going to get all red. Um, my point is, is I really want to be able to help people and... Whether they're laughing at me, laughing with me, or it's for charity, I'm happy either way. So, I hope that answers that part. Uh, regarding my personal life, it's, um, I don't know, it's, it's, I've become in a, I, I've created a routine for myself. And in this routine, normally it's Monday nights and Tuesday mornings I actually record, um, Mostly for the week. I have actually pre-recorded uh, up until like three weeks. So that was very nice. That really helped me. And I might end up doing that again. Um, but um, I normally record on Mondays and Tuesdays. And then edit for Wednesday, Friday. And then I record, of course, on Sunday. Edit and post on Sunday. Um... That may actually change. Uh, you'll see why next week, probably, and I'll explain it a little bit more next week. It's a little secret now. Uh, but uh, my whole schedule might change just a little bit, and it's not. It's, it's going to be for the better. It's not really. I'm. I'm not going to change any of my times right now. Like everything's still going to go up. I don't remember exactly what time it's supposed to be going up. I think I know. I click on 11:30. Uh, uh, local time, so, I, I don't know why it says minus five on there, uh, when it should be minus six, because I'm central, um, but, it should be up at 11.30 every day, well, every, uh, Wednesday, Friday, and whatever time I actually get it done, and up on Sunday is when it's going to be done and up, um, so I've had to work around that a little bit, I've, I don't know, I've, I've made time for this, and I, I really want to emphasize how much this is, like, made, I don't know, it's, it's changed me for the better, and, I don't know, I love this, like, you guys are fantastic, I don't know what I would, where I would be if it wasn't for this channel and all my potters out there and everybody else who's viewing, but I don't know why you're not subscribing, just hit that button. Uh, well, you don't have to. I'm, I'm just saying. It's all for you guys. and It just... I don't know. Thank you. That's all I gotta say is just thank you. Because... Thank you. I, I don't... I, I don't know how to explain it. It's just awesome that I can even be in this position. So, thank you guys. Love you guys. You guys fucking rock. If you could play only one game that your channel is based on, and in this game... You have full skills to edit, what game would you play, and what edits would you choose? Well, since it's going to be one of those uh, skill-based games, I gotta go with uh, Elder Scrolls. 
and if you're being more specific, probably Skyrim, just because Skyrim was freaking amazing. Um, but yeah, that's just that's it. Just go Skyrim, and the the skills that I would actually use is that since that's the only game I'm gonna be playing, I'm gonna have a lot of time on my hands, <laughs> and I'd probably go through everything, like all the skills. I I'm more of the rogue ranger type anyway, so I'd probably stick with those primarily. I would play through everything else, but those are those are my main builds. When you first started work making videos. Were you worried about voiceover and face cam and embarrassed by these things? I don't know if I was really worried, but I definitely was embarrassed just because first time actually getting my voice out there, I don't really like the sound of my voice being recorded, per se. Um, and just just look at me, I'm not nothing special. Like, there's really nothing special with this face except, you know, nothing. So, I guess I really wasn't worried, technically. Uh, maybe a little embarrassed just by some of this stuff, but never really worried, and I really wasn't that embarrassed too much. If you could be any type of biscuit, what would you be and why? Well, that depends. Are you from the UK? Or not? Nah? Because in the UK, technically, um, the UK's biscuit is the United States cookie. So, would I be a chocolate chip biscuit? Or would I be Raisin Bran Crunch or something like that? I know that's cereal, but you know what I mean. Um, so, um, in America, I like buttermilk biscuits. Just because, I mean, they're they're American biscuits. They're fluffy, they're flaky. Uh, they go, go, they go good with gravy. Fluffy, flaky, good with gravy. <laughs> Oh, it and I didn't even know it. Um, but if you're talking like a UK biscuit, I like molasses cookies, and I don't know if you call that a biscuit, but yeah, I know some people like to have their biscuits and top it with like chocolate and stuff, so that would be pretty good too. Yeah. If you added it all up, how much does your gaming setup cost in total? Well, I mean. I really don't know. I'm guessing it's probably around fifteen hundred, um, but really that doesn't matter. I was using a two hundred dollar computer to pump out pretty much all my other videos before I got Le uh, Lily. So honestly, it doesn't even matter how much it costs. Um, it's just the hard work you put into it, and it's all the the effort you put into making your videos. That's actually what counts. Um, yes, if you have the more expensive stuff, you can probably afford uh, a better CPU, better GPU. You can afford the RAM sticks to, you know, you can just afford all of that. And you'll be able to access more. But, I mean, as long as you're doing quality videos, I don't think it's a, it, it, I don't think it matters how much it costs. But since you asked, it's probably around $1,500 uh, adding up the computer, the monitors. Uh, the TV, and the PS4. Is it Sunday? Where did the week go? I think it ran that way. Did you look under the bed? So anyway, guys, I hope you enjoyed uh, this q and I love doing these just because I want you guys to get to know me as well. And I want to get to know you guys. Um, so in the comments below, message me how you guys are doing. And um, answer some of these yourself. Like... What kind of biscuit would you be? Um, you don't have to answer if it's Sunday because I think it is. Yeah, probably. But anyway, guys, thank you so much for watching. And remember to share, comment, like, subscribe, and most importantly, you do you.